Sue from Port Bolivar has a question about duck sizing. Well, she's looking for your help, Tom. Sue writes, I remember you having a guideline for sizing uh, return air ducks. So mm. many square feet, inches per so many tons of AC. And she says, I can't find them anymore. And she wants, can you give her this guidance? Yeah, the old rule was with the old polyester filters, mm -hmm. the really cheap ones that we grew up with right. when we were little tykes right. in the 60s. It produced us. <laughs> yeah, it produced us. <laughs> it was one square foot per uh, ton. And that means surface area, depending on the size of the filter, the surface area. So one square foot per ton. Then we got into the better filters, which were the pleated filters, the MERV 7s and the MERV 8s. And that would be one and a half square feet per ton. And so it can be a much bigger sized return air. If you have it too small, like we've experienced mm -hmm. here, even in your building, mm -hmm. it will restrict the airflow. It'll be noisy. The air conditioner won't work properly. So you want a lot of airflow. Now, you can exceed that, but that's your minimum. All right. And... Would this be a case where more is better? To a point. I mean, more okay. is better. You, it's really right. hard to get past that. So get them all over the house if you can. Uh, but the fact of the matter, some guys will say, well, more is not, you know, you get to a point. Well, yeah, if you open up the house to the outside, then <laughs> it's not going to be good. Be, yeah. <laughs> so, what, are you trying to air condition the whole block? <laughs> that's it. So, yeah, it sounds like your father. For the father. most part, right. a lot is good. All right. And we like a lot when you send us your questions to homeshowradio.com. We can help you with your projects. You can check out other videos here. And uh, please subscribe to our channel.